Wow. Today we're going to have another look at the folding fin toggle bolt shotgun rounds. And what I did, I took a 50 caliber ball, drilled and tapped it and threaded it on there. I want to thank Ben for providing those to us. Now when this projectile is shot, the fins snap open and kind of self-regulate themselves and kind of behave like the wings on an F-14 fighter. In our first test, we were pretty amazed these actually worked. So a lot of viewers wanted us to shoot them at a further distance. So that's what we're going to do for you today. This video is probably more relatable to people who are into aerodynamics, aeronautics, uh, maybe like Kerbal Space Program. And we're just using a shotgun as our source of propelling these things. Now, the energy of a shotgun is pretty tremendous. They can have about 10,000 PSI of pressure behind the wadding, and that all has to be transferred to that toggle bolt dart. Unfortunately, in this case, it just ripped the wings right off of it. Okay, shot two, whenever you're ready. That one went bouncing, that one's cool. Yeah. <laughs> Now this time, instead of the projectile breaking apart, it was actually the plastic wadding that broke apart. The pressure was too great. Maybe the distribution of the forces from the dart to the wadding w didn't have very good contact there. So the wadding just blew apart. We lost a lot of energy and the dart just traveled at a slow velocity. All right, ready? Yeah. <laughs> I, I can literally watch that one though. Yeah. So once again, the wadding blew out, sending most of the energy just zooming around the projectile, so we didn't have very high velocity. So we haven't quite found that fine line between overpower and underpower yet, but it's definitely very complicated to get something that survives being launched, has enough velocity to stabilize itself, and something that will actually stay on target and be accurate. Wow. Okay, that had a lot more kick, and it just missed. That's all it did. We definitely heard a different sound this time. A lot more power. Uh, this time the projectile went out about 10 yards, and one of the wings actually broke off at that point. But the folding fin dart was definitely traveling at a very high velocity this time. And it just barely missed, actually. So we're getting we're getting better here. We're making some improvements. All right, go ahead. Holy man, we got a hit. Definitely we had a lot higher velocity this time. Looks like the wadding still managed to shred. Uh didn't really look like the fins deployed possibly they were still folded up kind of in that f-14 high-speed mode but still stayed on target just shot a little bit high but still pretty impressive got it <laughs> one way or another yeah got it now this was definitely a lower velocity round it took a little bit longer for it to reach the stop sign. However, the fins did deploy. They didn't stabilize it very well. As you can see, it's waggling along, but even despite that, it stayed on target. It was a little bit of a low shot, but uh, very complicated round compared to something like a lead slug, you know, which nothing can go wrong really there. But we had a lot of fun doing this. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.